so now we'll discuss a very simple starting with a very simple combinational logic circuit so we'll be starting with uh, the arithmetic circuits okay the arithmetic circuits this this category so the arithmetic circuits they are used for performing arithmetic operations addition subtraction multiplication division okay now basically the multiplication and division operations they are process of repeated addition and repeated subtraction so they are manipulated in a form that we can use the same addition and subtraction circuits for multiplication and division so basically you will have half and full adder and half and full subtractor here we'll be discussing a simple one which is the half adder circuit so before that before discussing the half adder a quick review of the binary addition rules okay if you remember uh, in binary addition we have the following four rules 0 pl uh, plus 0 which is equal to 0 0 plus 1 is equal to 1 1 plus 0 1 and here 1 plus 1 the result is 0 with a carry of 1 okay this is the you know four rules which are very important when it comes to uh, half adder and full adder circuits okay so half adder is an arithmetic circuit block which is used to add only two bits okay two set of bits like this following these four rules here the carry at the input is not taken into consideration okay so it will only perform addition of two bits okay 0 plus 0 0 plus 1 1 plus 0 1 plus 1 this much but triple bit addition or more than that it will not do that this it cannot do like this it cannot do okay it is not possible in half order so it is only used to add two bits so the basic building the block diagram of a half order it's something like this it has two input and two output the two inputs here i have represented them with a and b they represent the two binary bits which have to be added together so it has two outputs one is the sum and the other one is the carry for example let's say here we have uh, 0 0 so here 0 plus 0 the sum is 0 okay and there is no carry so carry will also be 0 then let's say we have the this thing will do 1 plus 1 let's say we have 1 and 1 here 1 plus 1 the result is 0 but there is a carry of 1 so that carry bit will be activated here similarly 1 plus 0 the result will be 1 with a carry of 0 0 plus 1 the result will be 1 with a carry of 0 only in this case 1 plus 1 the result the sum it will be 0 with a carry of 1 so the carry bit will be activated and it will show 0 okay so this is the thing now the output expressions of each you know this sum and carry output lines so the output the sum output it is given by this expression a bar b or a b bar so this plus it represents or and this product it represents actually and a bar and b or a and b bar so 
when i say a bar b it, rep it means a bar and b and this plus it represents or or operation or a b bar a bar is the complement or not operation on that the invert inverting operation okay so you can uh, you know you read it as a complement b or a b complement or a bar b or a b bar whatever way you feel comfortable so this is nothing but xor output so this is also written as a xor b okay a bar b or a b bar and the carry output it is given by simply the product or a and b of the two inputs a b a and b so it is given by the and gate so there are two gates which we can use to directly give the two outputs first one is the xor gate for the sum operation and and gate for the carry operation so this a b the two inputs are given first to the xor gate we get the output a xor b which is nothing but a bar b or a b bar and this is the carry output which is a and b okay or a b simply okay so this is the simplest way of representing the half adder logic circuit and then the truth table of the half adder it is something like this so it has two inputs so the various input combinations 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 so here the xor table if you remember when both the inputs are of the same type the output is 0 when they are of different or complemented versions of each other the output is 1 so 0 0 1 1 same inputs output is 0 some output is 0 because it is xor and 0 1 1 0 one input is the complement of the other opposite type so in that case the output is 1 and here for the carry output which is simply the AND operation the output of the AND gate when either of the input or both of them is 0 the output will obviously be 0 when both of them are 1 or high logic high then only the output will be 1 ok 1 represents logic high, 0 represents logic low. So, I have uh, explained in detail about the various logic gates uh, in detail, then about the various uh, simplification of Boolean expressions, various ways of representing the Boolean expressions, sum of products, SOP, product of sums, POS, max terms, min terms, Carnot maps, Quine McCluskey method. So, all that I have discussed in the digital electronics playlist. You can check that out. So, this is the truth table. Okay. So, this is one of the simplest uh, arithmetic logic circuits consisting of two inputs, two output, one sum, one carry, sum, which is basically the XOR gate output, the XOR operation, and the carry which is basically the AND operation ok. So, this is the uh, simple half adder circuit ok.